Okay, so think back to when you were 19 years old. What were you doing with your life? Studying in college, maybe? Maybe working at your first full-time job? Well, for Bourbon County native Addie Lobby, it was the year she founded her own fashion business, Styles by Addie, an intimidating prospect in the midst of a pandemic. But thanks to a little bit of innovation and some help from her friends, she not only persevered, but she even found success. KOIM's Michael Hayslip reports. 20-year-old Addie Lobby has been in the fashion business for almost as long as she can remember. Um, I've been traveling with my mother for 15 years, ever since I was like five or four, and we've been traveling and selling jewelry, so I've always been in this business. So literally, since kindergarten, she has been designing jewelry. Addie spends most of her day here, designing and crafting the items her mother sells to boutiques all over the country. But in her off hours, she started a business of her own. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. So today I have my beautiful model, Kinley, of course. She's always with me and we are going to show you lots of cute outfits. Plus this one I am wearing right here and hers. I know you guys have seen this jacket and I know you love it because I also love it. Every Wednesday at 5, Addie and her friends sell clothing and jewelry through Facebook Live. It's been a very interesting ride. It's, yeah, it's been a lot. <laughs> yeah, it's a very big learning curve, but it's super yeah. fun. The transition from the first live to our most recent live, it's like way more smoother it's and way so more different. confident. Yeah, the first one we're like, <laughs> yeah, these are our clothes. <laughs> and then that was really it. But now we've really gotten into the groove of it and yeah. it's just smooth. Running an entire storefront through a digital space may seem unorthodox, but for Addie, it's the only way it made sense. It, this is a better avenue for me because we live in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Um, we're a homegrown business. We're like a family business. And instead of like having people come here, then we can just sell online. But if you just sell online on a website, no one gets to see the clothing. Yeah. I've been doing this for a long time and I realized how much I love putting together outfits yes. and finding things that look good on all body types. Even as she forges her own path forward, the young entrepreneur's not afraid to wear her inspiration on her sleeve. And I think she's around so many women-owned businesses and they empower other women and they have also given her the confidence to take off and do her own thing. And the confidence to succeed. I see it going pretty big. I hope <laughs> I see it going fantastic, I honestly. Hope. Michael Hayes. The original plan for the business was to save some money for college, but with all of her success, Addie says she might have to change that plan. You can find a link to Styles by Addie in this story on our morning show page at koamnewsnow.com.